hey guys welcome to my channel in today's video i'm going to show you guys how i hand painted this beautiful graduation cap for my mom she's actually graduating with her master's saturday and guys i am so so proud of her so when she asked me to customize this cap for her you guys know that i had to do it for her so i started off with a sketch on regular copy paper and i decided to go ahead and freehand from that onto the cap so here you can see that I'm drawing everything out. I didn't really know how to tackle this. So this is my first time painting um, something like this. So I just started to, decided to go ahead and start with the letters. And the words on this is actually a scripture, Philippians 4.13, which reads, I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me. She wanted that verse. It was very important that she had it on there. So I really wanted to stand out. And the way that I did that was by putting gold glitter. So here you can see that I'm like hand painting every single letter with the gold glitter. Um, I mix Mod Podge and really fine gold glitter together. And this is exactly how it, you can see how it's coming out. Um, I started on the bottom portion, which I would suggest that you guys start on top. And actually, as I was doing it, I started to come with a little pattern. And I suggest that you guys start with the very last letter and work backwards. As you can see here, I'm starting with the S and then the N and so forth. So, yeah, um, my mom, she wanted to have this verse on here, this Bible verse. She also wanted to have some lily flowers. My grandmother that passed away, which is her mother, um, her name was Lillian, which is my middle name, and everyone called her Lily. So we kind of represent lily flowers with her. Um, my aunt, which is her sister, um, she also passed away. So I thought it would be nice to have two lilies. So I made sure to add that in there. And then she also wanted to incorporate a Puerto Rican flag that you will see me paint soon, which is um, our background. So, yeah, I'm really happy with the way this came out, guys. I used a really tiny, tiny, tiny brush. I had to use a zero zero. It was so tiny. Um, here, I'm starting to paint the lily flower. And once again, I didn't know how to tackle this. I actually ordered some golden GAC 900 and it is a heat set fabric painting medium, which reminds me, I need to heat set that. But um, all I, it says that you mix one, one ratio. So here I'm just using white acrylic paint and I'm mixing it with the medium and the medium makes it like really watery. I like... People have different preferences for paint. I like my acrylics nice and nice and thick. Um, and I just kind of just started like that. I went with the white. I added some pink. And I'm just adding layer by layer different colors until I get the look that I want. Um, I'm trying to think. If you guys wanted to paint something like this, what suggestions I would give you? Um, that stuff really worked really, really well. I really don't think that this was needed for the cat because, I mean, I think that the uh, fabric painting medium could be used more for, like, something that you would wear more and throw in the washer, like a jacket or something. But, yeah. And here, I'm painting the Puerto Rican flag, and I actually started off by using white so that the colors can be really, really vibrant. And while I was painting throughout this entire piece I kind of covered up some of the letters so here I'm going back in with that mixture of Mod Podge and gold glitter and I'm just cleaning everything up and making everything look cohesive as you can tell there's like some blue on the edges I actually taped that part off because I wanted to get a really nice clean look right now i'm not sure whether i want to add rhinestones or not but this is the finished piece guys look at how beautiful it is it's so shiny and glittery and i just think that it came out really perfect guys give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed this video i hope that you guys love this and i hope that you try this out for yourself i love you guys and i'll talk to you next time bye